Hong Kong has suspended kindergarten and primary schools until next month to slow the spread of COVID-19. All in-person classes and playgrounds will remain shut until the beginning of the Lunar New Year break, after which the city administration will start its vaccination program for children above the age of five. The chief executive of Hong Kong, Carrie Lam, announced the latest measures in a weekly media briefing. I will announce today that all of Hong Kong's kindergartens and primary schools must temporarily stop face-to-face -face classes all the way until the Lunar New Year holiday. In other words, only if we get the epidemic under control will they be able to open after Lunar New Year. And by that point, we will start organizing vaccination programs at the school. The decision was made after three COVID-19 cases were found in young children who attended playgroups or kindergartens. The schools they attended had to be shut down. All their teachers and the children who were close contacts were then put in mandatory quarantine. Many schools also saw recent outbreaks of respiratory diseases with symptoms similar to the Omicron variant of coronavirus. Children will receive their vaccination at school, but the authorities have not yet specified whether these vaccinations would be made compulsory. Secondary schools will continue with in-person teaching, with current measures already in place. Hong Kong's international airport, meanwhile, will ban passengers from high-risk countries for a month from January 15th. However, Bloomberg reports that this ban will not apply to diplomats, government officials, athletes and staff participating in the Winter Olympics.